Hi everybody. Today I have an amazing question for you. So if here is a rectangle A B C D. Now in this rectangle draw a line from point A to the line C B. Similarly draw a line from point D to the line C B such that the upper three parts has the area of 4 15 and 26 as shown on the screen then what is the area of this remaining region so please give your trial to this question and keep watching for the solution now in our finger let these sides be x y and z and let the length of the rectangle be h now join this line and let the area of this region be a and similarly let the area of this region be d now join the another line now looking at this triangle and this triangle now these two triangles have same area because both lie on same base and both are between same parallel so after subtracting this common area we can say that this triangle has also the area equal to d now let the area of this triangle be c now looking back in our original figure so we can simply say that a plus d is equals to 15 and c plus d is equals to 26 now write this result in the corner let the area of the region that we have to find be f and let the width of the rectangle be g so area of region d plus f is equals to 1 by 2 times base which is g and altitude in this case it is h and g times h is area of rectangle so d plus f is equals to area of rectangle by half now looking in remaining region in rectangle so area of rectangle minus half of area of rectangle is equals to a plus 4 plus d plus c so area of half of rectangle is also equals to a plus 4 plus d plus c now we getting both equations we get so d plus f is equals to a plus 4 plus d plus c now subtracting both sides by d so we get this now adding both sides d plus d so f plus d plus d is equals to a plus d plus 4 plus c plus d now using the values that we find so a plus d is equals to 15 and c plus d is equals to 26 so f plus 2d is equals to 15 plus 4 plus 26 so d is equals to 45 minus f by 2 so write the result on so in the corner now looking in this right triangle area of this figure is equals to half times of y plus z times h now looking in this right triangle area of this figure is equals to half times of y plus x times h now adding this both area so we get area of region 4 plus d plus c plus area of region 4 plus d plus a is equal to y plus z times h plus y plus x times h by 2 we know that a plus d is equal to 15 and c plus d is equal to 26 so putting these values and take h as common so we get 8 plus 26 plus 15 is equal to h times of y plus z plus y plus x by 2 we know that g is equals to x plus y plus z because opposite sides of rectangle are equal so 98 is equals to h times of g plus y now let it be our equation first now using similarity rules in triangle f and a triangle having area equal to 4 so f by 4 is equal to square of g by y so g is equals to y under root f by 2 
now using this value of g in our first equation so we get 98 is equals to s times of y under root f by 2 plus y so 98 is equals to s times y times under root f by 2 plus 1 now we can write this also as 98 is equals to s times y by 2 times under root f plus 2 now looking in this triangle area of this triangle is equals to half of y times h now putting this value in our equation so we get 98 is equals to 4 plus d times under root f plus 2 now putting the value of d that we found so we get 98 is equals to 4 plus 45 minus f by 2 times under root f plus 2 so 98 is equals to 8 plus 45 minus f by 2 times under root f plus 2 now multiplying both sides by 2 so we get this now opening the parenthesis so we get this and after simplification we get 196 is equals to 53 under root f plus 106 minus f under root f minus 2f now for solving this equation let f is equal to alpha square so putting f is equal to alpha square we get 0 is equal to alpha q plus 2 alpha square minus 53 alpha plus 90 for finding the real roots of this equation we have to do the prime factorization of the constant term in this case it is 90 so 90 is equal to 2 times 3 times 3 times 5 now the real root may be 3 may be 2 or may be 5 so after putting val the values one by one we get there are only two real roots of the polynomial f alpha which are 2 and 5 so f may be a 2 square or 5 square now looking in our original figure f may be 4 or 25 now if f is equals to 4 then by a similarity rule we can say simply says that both of these both triangles are equal it means da have to be equal to y but but this thing changes the diagram of the original figure so to make diagram as it is that it has given so f is exactly equal to 25 and that is our correct answer